Greetings, programs. Are you here? This is Wretch. Welcome back to Sherlock Holmes, The Devil's Daughter. This is right after leaving the room. So, uh, there wasn't a travel montage at all. Which was crazy. Um, I really have no idea where to go. But this was the entrance to the old cemetery, so... Which it doesn't look like we can get into. Let's do some running. Maybe it's back here where this kind of delusion started. So we've got some stuff. We're at Highgate Cemetery, for sure. Maybe we can find some sort of entrance around here somewhere. A hole in the fence, perhaps. I'm really curious as to what has happened to Kate. And how, how it really pertains to Alice and just this whole weird vibe that's going on. Maybe we need to climb up here on these rocks. Oh, come on, Holmes. I know you're more... <laughs> oh! Here we are. Kate, what did she do to you? Crossing. On the crossing? Trampled by feet. Okay. Frame rate's gone a little bit wonky here, guys. I apologize for that. Fell by bullet. Scholar of Rose. Earth digging giant. Earth digging giant. Find the crypt. Ugh. There are four others. Go to the old cemetery. Well, we... These writings constitute a single message, a guide. Hmm. Inspect the crypt of Alice's father. Go to the old cemetery and find the crypt on the crossing of four others. Felled by bullet, scholar of roads, earth digging giant, and trampled by feet. All right. Uh, what about the rest of this? That's where Alice's father was buried. So this is where the seance was held. Alice brought them to perform the ritual. Those candles have been alight for almost three hours. Hmm. So who knows what might has... What has happened to Kate since then. Now we had a briefcase here. Kate's diary. I'm with Alice at the cemetery. We're going to speak to her father. The ceremony scares me, of course, but I'm excited too. I shouldn't allow myself to feel scared, as what is to follow will be even scarier. She's so beautiful. She's prepared the candles, the portrait. She looks so relaxed. I cannot prevent myself from trembling. She begins. She calls him. She is turning in on herself, and she is muttering. I cannot understand as she speaks a strange language. She is holding chalk sticks in both her hands. I'm trembling. I cannot help it. Her eyes are white. Her movements are convulsive, as one in the throes of death. She doesn't see me. She begins to speak to him, and it's horrible. I want to cry. She is writing everywhere with both sticks of chalk. Hmm. Wow. I can't believe that Alice made my little girl go through all this. Damned woman! I agree. Looks like we have a door here to go through. Kate? Oh my god. Whoa! It's Alice's father mummified. Hi. How you doing? It's Alice's father mummified. Yeah. Snake Nest and Conspiracy. In the district of St. Victor, while in the act of demolishing an old house, Masons have uncovered a nest of snakes which... We've read this already. 
The reptiles didn't have at the bottom of a well long since dried up. In the middle of this snake nest, there was the skeleton of a child who had likely plunged down the well to his or her death. Surprisingly, the skeleton in question was still holding a red Morocco portfolio, much disintegrated apart from one legible strip of paper which read, Do not reveal the plot. Hells, bells. Madam Destiny. Madam Destiny. A map of British rivers. Okay. A storm run. Alice keeps her father's belongings in this room, even the canteen from his boat. Please don't stand up and attempt to kill me. I I will be most displeased. Alice sleeps here. Alice is not merely peculiar, she is mentally ill. I hope Kate didn't see this. Yeah, this is some Which, Alice. She brought my daughter even further. They followed this direction in, in this message. They went to the old cemetery. So this is some Norman Bates stuff. Only Alice didn't pretend to be the dad. Kate's suitcase. Why did she leave it here? Can we take it? And bash Alice over the head with it? I guess not. And now the gates are surprisingly open. This is no bueno. Hold on, Kate. Inspect the cemetery crypts, find and select four which are referred to in Alice's message. Use imagination to visualize them. Go to the old cemetery, find the crypt on the crossing of four others. Felled by bullets, scholar of roads, earth digging giant, and trampled by feet. I need to recall some facts about certain famous people buried in this cemetery. Painter of miniatures from Oxford had three daughters. Scholar of roads, earth digging giant, trampled by feet. Hmm. Okay. William Shaw owned a uh, British remains archaeologist. Was seven feet tall. Earth digging giant. Okay, which one was this? William Shaw. All right, let me uh, choose that one. John. Governor of Jamaica, grandson of the Archbishop, had lush whiskers. Nope. That does not fit the motif I'm going for here. What's up here? Archibald Irwin, cartographer, preferred coffee, produced a map of all major roads in England. There's the scholar of roads right there. We need to find the crypt on the crossing of four others, which means we got to find, I think, the center point where all of them converge, perhaps? Unnamed crypt. Hmm. That's not suspicious at all. Cyrus Verfores Ponsbe, botanist, died of typhus, elected at Eton College. No. That doesn't really fit anything. Liam, Irish by birth, prominent fish merchant, amateur boxer. Explorer, was killed by an el- oh, trampled by feet. Killed by an elephant. Another unnamed crypt. And felled by bullet, was shot in a duel. Henry Anthony Evans. Let's, uh... Use imagination here. Oh, I was not aware we could do that. Hey! Is that it? So, by that rationale... It should be... This one. Knock, knock. Now I wonder whose crypt this is. Kate! Kate! Oh, that was some Temple of Kate, Doom. my dear child. I do not know when you will hear this message, but I do know that one day you will be here, Kate. My blood, my light. I rue the day I lost you. 
Death is nothing to me except to leave you behind and with him. Holmes. <laughs> Sherlock Holmes. Well, you have to understand, he is your worst enemy. But because he so loves to hide behind the mask of his dubious morality, he would never... This has to be Moriarty. Holmes. Holmes, Holmes. I'm certain that he never understood you. I'm sorry for that. I hope you didn't cry too often having him as your father. I trust that you made him cry. <laughs> Don't distress yourself, my child. I died by his hand. But your questions are over since you now know. You are my daughter. What matters is that you continue my work. Join our cause and you'll be the Empress of Evil. My gate, my flesh, before Holmes's eyes and in front of the world. Kate Moriarty has arrived. There we go. Confirmation. Hmm. Well, the whole... Moriarty. You. That whole Empress of Evil thing was kind of melodramatic, though. He knows everything now. Why did it have to be like this? Maybe Alice was Moriarty's lover? What we got here? Young Kate. Okay. Little star with an extremely precise carving. The dynamics of an asteroid. A work by Professor James Moriarty. My observation of the asteroid movement through my telescope led me to the discovery of two new stars, which I called Maroc and Adhil. Together with other dim stars, they create a marvelous constellation, and its shape reminds me of my dear girl Caitlin. Okay. Metal star with an extremely precise carving. So we need to find whatever that is related to. And now Holmes is doing his I'm distressed walk. That's a ribbon from Kate's hair. From childhood's hour I have not been, as others were, I have not seen. As others saw, I could not bring my passions from a common spring. From the same source I have not taken, my sorrow I could not awaken. My heart to joy at the same tone, and all I loved I loved alone. Then in my childhood in the dawn of a most stormy life was drawn. From every depth of good and ill, the mystery which binds me still. From the torrent or the fountain, from the red cliff of the mountain, from the sun that round me rolled in its autumn tint of gold. From the lightning, from the lightning in the sky as it passed by, or it passed me flying by, from the thunder and the storm and the cloud that took the form, when the rest of heaven was blue, of a demon in my view. Kate's poem. Oh, yeah, that's nice and dark. Very Victorian. Kate met her true father. I need to find Alice. I'll make her speak this time. Mm-hmm. Return to Alice on Baker Street. Professor James Moriarty. Because I could not stop for death. Kindly stop for me. The carriage held but just ourselves. Immortality. That is an awesome epitaph. Holy crap. Stellar. So I guess in this world, um, Holmes did not die along with Moriarty at Reichenbach Falls. Beg your pardon? It's blocked from the outside. Uh-huh. Alice! Accept your death, you fool! You witch! Let me out! Free Kate! <laughs> Ooh. Come back, witch! Well, return to Alice at Baker Street completed. Indeed. Keep your head, Sherlock. This is the only way to get out of here. Okay, what are we doing here? Little star with an extremely precise carving. Okay, nothing yet. We have got to find the way out then. <laughs> the way is shut. Maybe Moriarty's face? Wait. 
See, it goes into the, like that. There's something. Something I'm missing here. Check the walls. Ah, hello. Moriarty must have set up an astronomer's riddle here. Moriarty must okay. have set up an astronomer's riddle here. That's fair enough. Is that what we use it for? Yeah, I beg your pardon? Oh, we have to make the constellation. I see. Okay. How exactly do we do that, though? I guess we can try and build it. Over. Oh, and it disappears. Oh, that's not nice. All the way over there. So we've got to find some way to kind of intersect everything. Let me let me see if I can do this here. This will be interesting. Just don't cross the streams, right? Simple. And then down here. And that looks good. And then back at the center. We got that one done. Um, wow, I was not expecting this, guys. Let's try up here. Down. Now, I don't think that one goes all the way that direction. Yeah, I think we're, I think we may be good. And then back up here. Can we... That way. Down here again. And up. I think we got it. It's all in the stars. Aha! Moriarty's secret snack chamber. Hold on, Kate. I'll find you. Of course, this is probably going to lead to, like, Moriarty's secret underground lair. Where Kate has already taken up a life of crime. Whoa, who is that? Watson. Holmes? She tricked me. She... Where's she gone? What's it? Where? I, I... I don't know. She left saying that she had to go and see a lady. A Mrs. Destiny? Madam Destiny, she's a boat. What? Over there, Watson. Where are we going? Find... She's abducted, Kate! I can't believe it. She's a lunatic, Watson. She made a room for her dead father, and now Kate is with her. Oh crap, why is the boat on fire? That is not good at all. They're on the boat! Hurry, Watson! Yep. Onward! That's why we have you, Watson, to row. Oh, I couldn't imagine what Holmes is feeling right now. Just watching it all go down. Alright. 
on to the boat, Watson. Stay here and hold on to the boat, Watson. Guess Watson's gonna stay there. That. Oh my god, no. Oh. Come on, I was just heroic and everything, Kate. I'm a Moriarty. I'm the devil's daughter. I'm good. I'm a monster. You are not a monster. What? That does not make you a monster. Ah. I only lied in order to protect you. You're still so young, my god. Ask Watson. I was lied to all of my life. Do you have any idea how that feels? To Oh no, you're a Holmes. No. Because you're Kate Holmes. And a Holmes never gives up. I know it. What? What? Oh. Woo! Well, there was the anchor. What? Uh. Holy crap, Sherlock! <laughs> yes, he knows. Nothing can change fate. Listen, he allowed George Hurst to kill Lord Marsh, who was already condemned to death by tuberculosis. Hmm. It's not your li ah okay. But this isn't your life. You have me. You? You sent me away. And when I'm home, we fight all the time. You're ashamed of me. Uh. No. Oh, it's me, Kate. I never learned patience. My own father was the same with me. It isn't possible to escape destiny! The Rasco gang didn't. Holmes failed to reveal their murderer. Their death was their destiny, Kate. Kate, don't listen to her! And Holmes will be murdered himself! I have foreseen it! Oh. Okay, gotta keep my hands on the keyboard. <laughs> oh, crap. Hey. It's the risk that I take, but my work helps to save other lives. Really? And albeit? And Percy Fleming, you save lives? No, you enjoy taking lives. You can't save me either. Kate, you'll be safe with me. I'll protect you. I care about you. How could you trust him? He killed your real father, Kate! Why? Why did you kill him? Uh... Eh... Uh. It was his life or mine. I had no choice, Kate. See? Everything is determined! Remember the sign! Our meeting! The ceremony! You were such a nice neighbor. Uh. Kate, no, no. How can, how can this suddenly mean more to you than your childhood? See, it is time. <laughs> the next life awaits us. Who? Kate, what sane woman would keep her father's mummified remains? She's irrational. I don't care. I don't belong anywhere. Hmm. Ah. Uh. You belong with me, Kate, with family. Daddy! I don't know what I'm doing. Help me! Quick time coming up. Yep. 
Dun 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 dun! Kate! Oh god! Are you alright? She really was the devil's daughter. Over here! Hurry! The boat's going down! Ooh. That was not a pleasant look. Hey, Daddy. I'm so sorry. I, I'm sorry too, Kate. I'm I'm sure Alice is fine. Hells, bells. Well, I guess we made the right decisions. The drawn curtain, Madam Destiny, the greatest test of all. Oh! Life of a consulting detective. So that was it. That was the game. Okay, I... I did not expect that. Well, I kind of expected it to be the end, considering we were having a reckoning, but... That was pretty fun. Um, I know these guys have made other Sherlock Holmes games... And um, I've heard good things about them. I really enjoyed this. It was a little bit short, but I had a really good time. I think this is one of those game styles that would be really good if it was done in an episodic or um, episodic form, kind of like the Telltale games. It doesn't really need to be open world, because um, I know they played around with a little bit of open world in this game. But doing episodes of different cases and stuff, I think that would be really cool. Um, I like this version of Holmes quite a bit, to tell you the truth. And I think I called it really, really early that I thought that Kate might have been Moriarty's daughter, especially when it was like that weird lineage thing. But that was cool. I like that. I like that a lot. I may actually try and play another um, Holmes game. I'm not sure. But we saved Kate and I guess that was all that matters. I wonder if there was an option to save Alice as well. If it was kind of based on your uh, moral choices over the course of the game. Huh. Well, good job from everyone at Big Ben Interactive and everyone else who worked on the game. I thoroughly, thoroughly had a blast playing this because I just, I love Sherlock Holmes. I, I eat up anything Sherlock Holmes related. And I guess it was, it, there's that really slight thing, and they did this in the, um, in the uh, Sherlock Holmes movie with Robert Downey Jr., that slight doubt on the occult, on whether some of the stuff may have actually been going on or not, especially with Kate. And maybe it's just that she was a psychopath, or maybe there was something more to it. Who knows? I like it when it's very gray like that, and they, they kind of keep that in the ether. But I, I liked Holmes, I liked Watson. It would have been cool to have Watson have more of a part to play, but this was definitely Holmes' story with Moriarty's daughter that he was trying to raise and having to experience things that the literary Holmes never really had to deal with. So, good stuff. But obviously, I will go ahead and end the series here. I hope you guys have enjoyed the ride. If you like the series, please leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, that'd be a big help. And we'll see you in the next series. Later days, everyone.